Germany just unveiled a combat drone that could change everything about European defense. The CA-1 Europa isn't just another military drone. It's an 11-meter autonomous fighter that can fly solo missions, swarm with other drones, or team up with manned fighter jets. This comes as Europe faces its biggest security crisis since the Cold War. Russia operates military bases just hundreds of miles from EU borders, while China and Iran expand their drone programs globally. Helsing's co-founder Torsten Ryle put it bluntly, Europe cannot afford to fall behind or become dependent on third parties. The numbers tell the real story here. This four-ton drone carries internal weapons bays and reaches high subsonic speeds without any pilot on board. But here's what makes this announcement different from every other drone program. Germany built this entirely without American technology. No US components, no foreign software, no outside dependencies whatsoever. The Europa uses Helsing's proprietary AI system called Centaur. This artificial intelligence pilot makes combat decisions faster than any human could process them. Think about what that means. A drone that identifies targets, evaluates threats, and executes missions completely on its own. The timeline reveals Germany's urgency. First flight happens in 2027. Combat readiness follows within four years after that. Why is Germany racing to deploy these drones so quickly? Look at who's already dominating the drone warfare landscape. America's Reaper drones patrol skies worldwide. Turkey's Bayraktar TB2s proved devastating in recent conflicts. China mass-produces military drones at unprecedented rates. Russia deploys Iranian-made Shahed drones against Ukraine daily. These attacks demonstrate how drones have become essential for modern warfare. Europe watched all this happen while depending entirely on foreign systems for protection. The Europa changes that equation completely. Its modular design accepts different sensors, electronic warfare systems, and weapon configurations based on mission requirements. One Europa can conduct deep precision strikes behind enemy lines. Multiple Europas can swarm together, overwhelming air defenses through coordinated attacks, or they can protect manned fighter jets as loyal wingmen. This versatility matters because European air forces have been shrinking for decades. Germany's Luftwaffe operates fewer combat aircraft today than at any point since World War II ended. The math is simple. Each manned fighter jet costs hundreds of millions. Training pilots takes years and millions more. But mass-producing autonomous drones costs a fraction of that price. And they never need rest, never require training, never risk pilot casualties. Helsing didn't just design software and hope someone would build the hardware. They acquired Grob Aircraft, a German manufacturer specializing in composite aircraft construction. This acquisition gives them complete control from AI development through final assembly. No supply chain vulnerabilities, no foreign dependencies, no technology transfers required. The Europa can operate from improvised airfields with minimal infrastructure. Dirt runways, highway strips, even damaged airports work fine. That capability matters when conventional airbases become primary targets in modern conflicts. But Germany isn't developing this alone. Helsing partnered with Systematic, the Danish company behind NATO's battle management systems. Gunbert Scherf, Helsing's other co-founder, explained why. What wins wars is not individual systems, but the ability to connect them and to iterate at the speed of relevance. Translation. The Europa will integrate directly with existing NATO command networks. European forces can deploy these drones alongside American, British and French systems seamlessly. The strategic implications go beyond military capabilities. Every Europa manufactured creates jobs in European factories. Every system deployed reduces dependence on foreign suppliers. Every successful mission proves Europe can defend itself. This sovereignty push accelerated after 2022's events in Ukraine. European leaders realized their security ultimately depends on capabilities they control completely. The Europa represents just the beginning. If successful, it becomes the template for an entire generation of European autonomous weapons. Will these drones match American or Chinese systems immediately? Probably not. But they give Europe something it desperately needs right now. Options that don't require permission from Washington or worry about supply chains through hostile territory. The real question isn't whether the Europa succeeds. 
It's what happens when dozens of European nations start deploying thousands of these autonomous fighters, because that's exactly where this leads.